Oklahoma quarterback Caleb Williams has busted onto the scene the past few weeks uh, against Texas and TCU. And anyone that watched the TCU game this past week and, and listened to the broadcast heard Herb Street talk about potential Heisman candidate. And at first you're like, wow, that's kind of outlandish. But then when you think about the candidates coming into the year and how no one's really taken the bull by the horn, if you will, uh, that slot is still there and still available. So could he win it? Potentially. But I want to take a few minutes and dive into the game film uh, against TCU and look at what he did well. And there's a, there's a lot that he did well. But the big things that, you know, watching film you kind of take away is one, the big play capability. So we're going to watch some of the big plays that he has. Two, he, what even is even more impressive to me is for a young guy to to go through progressions, the movement in the pocket, the pocket presence. We see him very calm in the pocket, good footwork in the pocket, uh, and then taking the defense gives him. So kind of the small things that he's doing well that for a young quarterback that has so much explosive capability can be difficult at times, he's doing that extremely well. And then, of course, uh, the use of his legs had some big runs, and then the use of his legs or use of the run game, some play action stuff to be able to hit receivers downfield. So just to, let's look at the, the box score super quick before we get in there, before we get into the film. He was 18-23. 295 yards and four touchdowns. So, uh, oh, he had a fifth touchdown on the ground. So if you count his rushing touchdowns, he had just as many incompletions as he did touchdowns. He also added 66 yards on the ground as well. So again, Caleb Williams, let's watch some big plays first. We're going to watch some, some, excuse me, I can't talk. We're going to watch some of the big plays first. Then we're going to watch some of the plays that I call um, kind of short to intermediate throws to the defense gives you moves in the pocket, eyes downfield, some of those running plays, and then the plays after play plays off play action. Before we dive into the film, I just want to encourage you all to consider subscribing to the channel if you like any quarterback related content. Boom. Let's get into the film. So this is one of many uh, quote unquote big plays for the Oklahoma offense. So we're going to see Caleb Williams hit his receiver here, kind of like a little seam corner type route, and he, he becomes wide open here. Uh, so really nothing to kind of break down, just a, just a big play here, right? So able to read it, steps in the pocket, again, wide open, right? The DB is like, what, five, six yards away? bit underthrown, but that's okay. Ends up being a big play uh, for a first down. That was a second and seven right there. That gets him down inside the 30-yard line. Just a big play there. So I'm going to go ahead and count this as a big play. In those, yeah, this is a big play. 25 yards downfield. So it's a good job. Williams is going to hit a receiver coming across down the middle of the field. But watch his patience in the pocket and him stepping up. Right, so he's going through his progressions. TCU just brings three. So eight. I've dropped back. Going through progressions. Eyes downfield. Stepping up. Stepping up. Takes a hit. Delivers a good ball. But that's yeah, about 25 yards downfield ends up being a first down for Oklahoma there. But goes through progressions, good arm strength downfield, and shows his eyes, uh, keeping his eyes downfield, being able to read eight defenders dropping back. So a big play there. So here's a touchdown to Hazelwood. I believe Hazelwood. Yeah, yeah, just a back shoulder throw. So this is his pre-snap look. He's looking at the safety, right? So during the pre-snap look, his mind said, okay, safety comes over, we'll do something else. But for the most part, he's looking to throw this all day, back shoulder stuff able to see the safety stay there right off the bat goes inward then you can see his head changes go to, to to look to the outside here so good job by williams reading him hell of a throw there great catch for a touchdown really good coverage there but just a good definition of throwing your guy open uh, for a touchdown so a lot to like about this play uh if, if you're a fan of williams or just a, a quarterback fan in general we're going to see him go through these progressions move in the pocket and deliver a ball downfield Right, so it comes in. I got a blitzing, blitzing backer out here. He's able to step up in the pocket. Eyes remain downfield. Hits his receiver right here, coming across from the field. Great read. Gotta be patient, not freak out when the blitz comes. Just smooth as can be, right? He just looks so calm and relaxed. That's a great example of, of just Williams overall and what he's done so far. Here's a deep out of Caleb, from Caleb Williams from the left hash of the field, right side of the field. Uh, good long throw. We see that TC probably dropped back into probably some type of quarters look here uh, a snap of the ball to corners bail good read by Williams and the ability to throw it from the left side of the field get it over this backer going curl the flats and in, in between this uh, corner back here as well we'll go ahead and kind of watch this play he's reading it the whole time again left hash great protection up front good ball there backer corner in between good ball good arm strength there uh, and good accuracy on a deep out there good job by Caleb Williams so here's the second and four, and Williams is taking the defense, gives him, we can't see, you can kind of see the helmet of the receiver he hits, just going to be a little hitch route here, but some of these plays that he makes are just as impressive as the, of the big plays, right? This is him understanding the offense, going through progressions, and, um, and, and taking plays that keep drives alive. So if the big play is not there, being able to hit this is actually more important down the road, right? So again, the big plays are, are, are awesome, 
uh, but these plays here help him develop as a quarterback as well. No one's open, goes through progressions, gets the ball to your receivers, and then the big play by Woods here, right? I think he gets all the way downfield here. We don't have to watch all of it, but uh, Williams recognizing, get the ball to your receivers' hands, let them make plays. So here we see Williams hitting a dig route or a, a just a cross route here. And so uh, pre-snap look, two top two high safeties here. All right, you have another DB coming back here. But, you know, you probably got middle of the field open depending what this backer does. So that's kind of his main read if he wants this dig route, which uh, he ends up throwing. Yeah, the, the guy is actually wide open. So we're going to watch that backer. Backer comes here. It actually ends up being more of like a cover three look. But middle of the field still is wide open because this backer is coming to number 27. Caleb Williams steps up in the pocket. Wide open receiver there, gets up field, so good read there, uh, good completion on that intermediate little dig route. So here's Williams, Williams with a long touchdown run. This is a great example of him uh, creating by himself, right? So uh, it's a called quarterback keeper, right? Well, at least potential uh, zone read here, he keeps it. So guy here. Guy here should be a stop in the backfield, but obviously we know down run by Caleb Williams. It just put them up, what, 45, 24, I believe, but just a good example of him creating uh, his own running lanes, his own running uh, uh, plays here. So here's a run from Williams, about four, four and a half minutes left in the third quarter here. We're going to see a good design run, but uh, Williams makes this run, right? So here, his pitch gets two guys out of the way, so he has the running back. He's supposed to have Williams no matter what. They both go to the running back. Take pitch, boom, get up field, one missed tackle, backer comes in, two missed tackles, then gets up field for the rest. Smart decision, doesn't take a hit, stays inbound. Just a good slide there, a good run by Williams. So here's a touchdown pass uh, uh, from Williams, and we're going to see just a fake run here. It's going to bring everyone in. Uh, the receiver is wide open here. So we're going to see just a fake here, boom, and he keeps it, keeps it, keeps it. Gets his eyes downfield. Look at how many people are. Look at him, these are all DBs. I oh, didn't really see that many touchdowns. So here we have TCU just bringing four, right? They're bringing a backer out here. I know I started the play early. I apologize. Uh, but Williams is going to roll out here and throw on the run. So just an example of him using his legs. Pressure comes. Doesn't freak out. Eyes downfield. Able to get the ball out to Woods for a first down. It's a really good throw, too, uh, on the run. So again, using his legs, uh, buying time with his legs, not freaking out, being patient, and throwing a good ball on the run. Here's a touchdown pass by Caleb Williams. This makes it 14 nothing to second and 12 right here. Uh, it's going to go to this receiver here. Kind of just, uh, he just came into motion. Kind of just runs like a little like glance. So that's like skinny seam route here. So we're going to see how the, the potential run game gets TCU's defenders out of position. Let's go ahead and watch this. Boom. So all looking, all looking. Ah, you can see the safety was looking in as well. So my bad. And then Williams is able to deliver a good ball for a touchdown. Uh, so again, the threat of the run game. Is kind of what helps that play develop there, and Williams able to make a good decision uh, for a touchdown pass. So love this touchdown throw uh, from Williams, and this read here very similar to I think either the first or second touchdown, whatever the touchdown was to number twenty-seven down here. Very similar, right? It's going to be a touchdown off the run game. So this is the safety Williams is reading. We're going to see a fake here from Williams in the run game. Watch the safety come up here, right? And then when he stops, it's too late. Receiver coming behind him. I believe Hazelwood is who he hits. Eyes get downfield, sees the safety, can't recover in time. Great ball for a touchdown. Actually pretty good coverage here, actually. Uh, but it was the right read. Makes a good accurate throw. Uh, touchdown there from Williams. So Williams is coming off the big come from behind performance against Texas. Uh, the five touchdown performance against TCU. And is there going to be any Heisman talk with with him? I don't know. Maybe uh, the fact that Herbsey brought it up, uh, you know, carries a lot of weight. But regardless, I want to do a film breakdown. Just look at what he did well against TCU. But I want to hear from you. What do you think about Caleb Williams' performance? And what do you think about his chances for the Heisman this year? Let us know in the comments below. We'll see you next time on the next quarterback-related video.